would assume that since we're still being prompted to open things, that we're supposed to be here. Well, if you want to open doors, all you have to do is shoot him, and that's hacking. Yep. Did you know that shooting things is hacking? Well, we're shooting them with... Like, with hacking. Yeah. We're shooting hacks. That's why it's called the spammer. Ah, Sergeant Vaughn. As much as I appreciate your services, I do nonetheless require oh, a minimum standard for the specimens you bring us. I need healthy specimens, not trauma victims! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just fill out a damn form. Appointment notice. Madam and Dr. Uh, Quaid are required in the interrogation block. I shall mention your slipping standards to Madame. See what she wants to do about it. Oh, gee, would you? That'd be just peachy, prick. Ew, let's kill that guy. What'd you he say? said, I need healthy specimens. And then, and Sergeant people. Vaughan. Yeah. A bad man. The worst. He knows the security system inside out. It's glitches, it's back doors. Follow him and steal his secrets. It's the only way you'll get close to Madame. <laughs> Hello, beautiful ladies. Time for your cavity search. <laughs> what if they're not criminals serving time? What if they're people and they're abducting them? Holy shit. It's still just as bad, though, if, even if they were criminals serving time. Yes, but I'm saying, like, what if they're abducting these people and experimenting on them, and that's what the Leapers are. The Leapers are botched experiments. And they're experimenting on people, and then people are like, hey, who's that? And they're like, oh, it's a criminal, don't, don't worry about it. Yeah. And everyone's like, oh, criminals! Yeah. what they do? Uh, an illegal thing? Oh, God! Yeah. An illegal thing? What? What illegal thing? Um, they, um, smoked doobie. Because he like, said they that they need he needs healthy specimens, meaning like, yeah, kidnap victims. Oh, is that him? No. What the fuck does that mean? Well, that's not him, is it's it? Her. Whoop. Uh oh. Whoopsie. <laughs> I'm now, okay with killing all these people. That's fine. Now everybody wait and approach her one by one. One at a time. One at a time, everybody. Oh. What was that? This attack is called a brain lock. You lose some focus and all your S present. Oh. I don't feel bad about these guys. No. They were complacent in a bad system. This is what you get for following authority! This is what you get for following authority. This is what happens. See? I told you, everybody. Kick remix Fuck the authority. Anti authoritarian rants again. <laughs> I wish I could flippy kick people. I'd just kind of like fall down. Like a hurricane kick? Yeah, I'd just be like, oh yeah? Well, oh, and then kind of like wiggle my leg in there and fall down and then be like, oh. Just as good, just as good. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. What? They have, I think that's the boss and they put her head. Huh? That must be her. They're like, a woman at 30? Put her head on some boobies, I can't handle this. Who's this douche? Frank, Frank Forlin. New save... whatever. Must be Saber Force something. Oh, it's that guy. Oh no, I'm trapped in a stinky man's locker room. Now what? Is that like a giant communal shower? Yeah, it looks disgusting. If it wasn't in here... Yeah. Uh -oh. Am I stuck in here? Oh, here we go. Whoops. I bet I could have snuck in there, but I was like, nah. Yeah. This is for everything you did to me! And that! Oh, 
for everything else I can't even remember. There you go, sis. You got the keys to the kingdom. La Bastille is yours. Did she just hair flip and sassy walk away from him? Wah! That's my revenge! Sassy walk! Oh, fine madame. It's kind of weird to call yourself a madame of a prison. But That's okay. not, it just means missus, though. It doesn't mean oh, madam. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is a French game. Yeah. I'm an idiot. Madame is just Mrs. Yeah. or like boss lady. I'm just checking for um memory plops. Look, another Triforce. Oh. Whoa. Hey. This is only 1242. Engaging fugitive. Oh, good luck. Oh, great. The junk bolt will break the heavy it forces shield. The junk bolt. Yeah. Okay. Careful. I need to I can't see. Give me your shit, nerd. I'm glad that the robots are silently going like whatever. Let her. Just going about their business. They're you know like, what? All this time we've probably been thinking that the robots are docile, but they're probably just going like, oh no, that's fine. <laughs> they're like, wow, you look like you're sure fucking shit up. Have fun. Psst, there's a thingy over here. <laughs> Why didn't you stop them? You didn't tell me to, master. <laughs> we didn't program you to laugh. I know. <laughs> Look at her. She's like, I know. I see you. Go. I see you, but you keep going. That door's open for a reason. Oh boy. Don't say low blow, you're in full combat armor. Yeah. I wonder if her cyber, is it cyber skin? That's what they're called? Cyber cool skin? Yeah. So I wonder if they make it so her legs are like... Super strong? Yeah. Not only super strong, but like armored yeah. without... So that way when she kicks with them, it just feels like being kicked with like a concrete block. What about her jeggings? <laughs> They're probably steel armored jeggings. Jeggings are the future. Explosive sense virus that will destroy enforcer shields and deal heavy damage to all targets in range. Let's Logic bomb. I'm just imagining like that That's person, me. the That's person who- Logic bomb! You know like that person on the internet who's like, you just got logic bombed and you're like, okay, well, I don't care. Okay, well you just used the word logic bomb, so <laughs> I think we know who the real winner is. Nobody. <laughs> Nobody is the winner. Wait, what? I don't understand. Yeah, it's just, I think it's just, uh. Oh. oh. Now dodge. Whoa! <laughs> oh, sweet! Ah, nerds, you just got logic bomb. You just got logic bomb! Whoa. Excuse me? I, might break I just nail? killed your friend! And you're talking shit right now? Killed two of them. Three of them. I just sent a bomb off in the middle of you and you're talking about nails? Given my nails are pretty long, I don't know why they're so long. I know it's not incredibly practical to have long nails, but if she wants to have them, she could scratch people's eyes out with those things. Yeah, man! It's a video game! <laughs> 
They do all sorts of implants. I'm sure she probably has like steel fingernails. I'm like willing to accept these combat heals just because it's like, I don't know. They're not the worst ones I've ever seen. No. And maybe they're like they those move. are those are very. Let me get reasonable. my memories back. Can we leave Vaughn on the shelf? I don't want to remember assholes like him. The past can't hurt you anymore, sister. Focus on the here and now. Oh, they're running away ah! now. <laughs> <laughs> you better run away. You want that health or where? You got health. Where? That to the right. That. You good? I guess I got it didn't give it to me. They're like, oh, she probably can't go through a locked door. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Security. Who's this? Oh Whoa. my God. Okay, Stacy, come on. Madame. Security breach in the guards' locker room. <laughs> Expand, please. Sergeant Vaughn has been attacked. Total memory wipe. I want that intruder found. Double patrols. I'm activating the brain drain. The only person allowed to play with memories here is me. Okay, you need to relax. Look at the tails on her coat. I think she's Hapa too. Could be. How come all the evil people are Hoppa? What the fuck? <laughs> the architect's not. Well, I just well, she's complacent in a complacent, society yeah. of badness. Oh boy. Oh shit! What Call the fuck? I don't know what that means. Just oh. stay out of the light, minute. I don't understand how to do that. Nope. Oh. Okay, now I understand. Well, I suck. Damn thing is sniffing through my memories. Where do I need to go? That's I'm not question. sure. Maybe I just need to go in a circle until I see an orange button. Probably. Ah, here we go. <laughs> Simple press of a button and whoosh. Cells on its way to maintenance. Just the place for an uninterrupted 40 winks. So he sleeps in a cell. Attention cell compromised. Do so many squats. I mean, her butt's a, her butt's pretty good, but it's not like I'm saying her butt is like is efficient looking. You know what I mean? Yeah. You hear that? The interrogation rooms aren't far. Get going. When I think lots of squats, though, I think a little more meat than that. Oh you no, know? her butt looks like it's like there's no fat. That's all muscle. Like if you slapped it in a non-sexual way, but as to test the consistency of the butt, it would be just rock. I know, but I think it would be bigger. I mean, she does all the all these kicks and stuff. You but think she's like she'd more, be more of a muscular, uh, like a gymnast body, though. If you see gymnast butts, um, yeah, and they're way more muscular than that. I feel like her butt is super muscular. Gymnasts are normally short, and they have very muscly legs and butts. All right, you know what? Maybe she's got a cyber butt. She has, like, a swimmer body. Okay, swimmer body. Long and lean. Long and lean sw swimmer cyber butt body. She, what if somebody hacks her butt? Now I'm worried. But, yeah, and, like, gymnasts usually have very big, like, shoulders and, um, well, muscles. Well, you know, 
when the day comes where we can have an extremely muscular, flat-chested female protagonist, that's going to be a magical day. But today, we have to have a swimmer body, so... I feel kind of weird spending so much time discussing her body. I was wondering how many squats she does. That's what I wanted to do. And then we were like, yeah. Gymnast. No. What? Which she one? doesn't have the body of, I'm telling you. She Gymnasts, has the body of a swimmer? Yeah. Gymnasts have, are way more buff on the bottom. Ooh. What is this now? Robot uprising! Robot uprising! Pretty sure... No, we gotta fight the robot. Yeah. I wonder what I can do to fight this robot. Oh, that's it? Yeah. You can only use the scammer to fight robots. I didn't know it was that easy. I thought it was going to be something difficult. Oh. Are you serious, guys? But yeah, most gymnasts are actually like 5'4 or 5'2 because you want to have a low center of gravity. Oh. I was figuring gymnasts because she does all so those flips. flips. Yeah. That's like, I mean, it's acrobatic. Um, maybe, maybe she's has, uh, I'm saying I'm at, I'm propositioning all these athletes because I'm wondering what body type would be optimal for the type of, like, athletics that she does. Probably some type of martial arts. True. Like, taekwondo or something. Actually, I really don't I don't know, know any martial arts, so we're just saying words now. I don't, yeah, I don't know the differences between all of them, but some type of martial arts, I would imagine. I like, though, one thing that I do like is that... Did you know that I used to be a gymnast? Uh, I did not know that. Yeah. I did gymnastics when I was little. That's, yeah. I, I, would, I wouldn't say it was gymnast. Yeah, so I used to do it when I was younger, and then, as you know, I'm very tall, and I got... Did you get too tall? I got, yeah, I got too tall, and the teachers told me to quit. They were like, you're never going to be very good. You're too tall, and you're only going to grow, so you might as well quit now while I, and, like, pick up a sport that you're actually going to be good at in the long term. I was like... I could flip on the uneven bars and do some other things, and then I was like, I'm done. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> Cartwheels are fun! I was going to say something else. What was I going to say? Something interesting, and now it's gone. I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, but I did gymnastics for a while. It was fun. I'm glad that I didn't stick with it, though. Actually, you know, I can't really say. I don't know. I feel like so many girls' sports are just like, like Whatever. those really no, those really intense like training sports are just breeding grounds for eating disorders. So it's like, you know, I watched my friends go through that with ballet and like. Yeah, it's when there when you have a sport that's so focused on your body as a machine and like your body composition, like ballet or gymnastics or even swimming. It's like. It's hard. Yeah. Hey. Dance. If you guys want to do sports, just do them, and then don't freak out too much about it. That's all I got to say about yeah. that. Just do it the best you can, and if somebody wants you to, like, do something that doesn't seem right, then don't do it. And also remember, at the end of the day, you're, it's supposed to be fun. And not, That's the like, point. something that you cry in your bed at night thinking about because you lost a game. Okay. Yeah. I mean, nobody likes to lose, be this way. but, so, I mean, it's okay to be bummed out and disappointed, but, like... And I know somebody's being like, oh, you guys don't know what it's like to be blah, and I'm like, no, I went to the Junior Olympics for swimming and for softball. Uh, I feel like... I enjoyed myself, but at the same time, there's so much focus 
on being the best that yeah. you can lose a lot of things that are important. So. Yeah. So what sports? You did softball, swimming, anything else? I w when I was younger, I did swimming, and I didn't really like it because I thought it was boring, but it was just something <laughs> It was just something to keep me in shape, and so I was, like, yeah. really muscular. I was, like, so buff. <laughs> I was so buff, and, be like, people would be like, how are you so strong? And I'm like, I swim all the time. Like, seventh grade, like, buff as fuck. There are pictures of me from high school, like, or, like, early high school, and I had, like, a six-pack. And I was like, holy shit, because, like, all I did was play volleyball and train for track, and that's, like, it. That was... I had, we, my school didn't have a softball team, so I had to play with the boys. Oh, yeah. You know how hard you have to train to be, like, half as good as a pubescent boy? Yeah. Ugh, I'm not very tall, so. And also to get them to take you seriously. Well, th thankfully, my school was not known for th its athleticism. <laughs> So I was able Sweet. to. So I was able to keep up decently well. Is this guy being tortured? I don't. I can't tell what uh. What's going on in here? Yeah. Can I do anything for you? No. Uh, Is he waiting for? Oh, he doesn't. He doesn't know what the fuck's going on. Yeah. So. These are interrogation rooms. I know, the two of us get on such tangents that we forget, like, what's going on in the... Which is un... Oh, no! Oh, boy. Let's... I don't want to think about that. Nope. We all know what that's about. I get so mad at inefficiency, because I'm like, this jail is not efficient! No. How is this cre... This is creating more problems, and you're gonna have to pay more tax dollars to, like, rehabilitate these people. You're making it worse. This is not efficient at all. And guess what? When you beat him up, now you have to take him to the medical place and pay for money there. What you could have done was... Why would they pay to take care of him? Well, there's medical supplies. But... Oh, they're just going to let him die? Yeah. Why would they? I keep thinking, well, like a rational person <laughs> where it's like... Yeah. They don't care. They don't care. It's true. There's blood on the walls and everything. Yeah. Like, this isn't... You, you think blood on the walls spells that they give a shit about what happens to these people? No. This is not, not efficient to me. This is not a, like an efficient workplace. Okay. They, like, look at all of this infrastructure. You know what's so stupid, though, is that they have the tools to, like you were saying, like, they could implant, they use the memories for good. And they, they could don't. Be like, they yeah. just use it to be vengeful. They could, like, give them knowledge to... Ah, damn it. Knowledge to, like, to have do, skills to do things or th and, like, anything like that. create things and... No, worry, we're go I'm trying to check for. This is all I can see. Oh, your no. memory hunters are all oh. so naive, <laughs> using your gifts for petty theft. <laughs> oh no! no! Creepy weird guy. No, Justin Timberlake. Stacy, she's hot, but I'm like really mad right now. <laughs> Little shrew, I'm going to teach you the real power of memory games. Can we... Oh yeah, now he's gonna think we came to save him and he's gonna be like our best bud forever. And when I've finished with you, you'll think you've always adored me. No, never! Silence! In time, you will willingly Give your life for me. Oh no. You mean like how we did to that other woman? Hmm? How we did to the blonde woman? Yeah. <laughs> we hey, let's save him. There's a the, there's an exclamation there's point. A, it, Stacey, it's I, a cutscene. It's now or never, sis. Snatch the access to the prison servers. Honestly, no, we gotta save the guy. To keep you out of here. How do I save him? Dr. Quaid is going to adore a new patient with such Vitality. How do I? You steal her memory. You know I know, what? but maybe At there's. Age, I don't want to just steal her memory. Mistakes, but nobody arrested me. If we can steal her memory from here, why can't we like? Fuck I don't know. Shit. Yeah. My God, Edge, that was bad request. They've got him. 
Don't get distracted. He'll be freed with all the rest. Follow Madame's remembrance to the memory servers. discuss with you the poor condition of our latest volunteers. Vaughn is letting Stan slip. Oh, I don't... Let's go this way. You'll save him. Edge. Okay, I'm in position. Let's do this. I love how we You're just a grade A hero, sis, yeah. I swear. You must be close to the entrance to the Panopticon, the central tower. That's where the memory servers are. Use the memory you stole from Madame to find a way in there. This is bullshit. He was nothing but kind to us. Okay, he was a little weird, but he like, was our friend! I, what? And I we're can just make gonna fun move on? I can make fun of somebody for being weird, but I'm not gonna, like, fucking abandon them. You do it to me all the time. I'm like, Stacy, you're weird, but if I saw somebody trying to steal your brain, I'd be like, no. You're like, you're weird, but you're my weird friend. It's like that one time we thought Sarah from Dragon Age was annoying, and then someone else said she was annoying. I was like, how dare you? I know. When other people were like, yeah, she seems kind of stupid. I was like, fuck you. How dare you say that? She's not stupid. She's just annoying. And then someone else was like, she is annoying. I'm like, shut up. I don't think I can say that. What's this now? What's going on? Why can't we go save Remember Guy? Leia, well, yeah, let's go up and touch him. Yeah, that's something. That's stupid. What? No. Yeah, that's not something. It, no. Why would she do that? <laughs> that's so what was dumb. your indication that she should do that? You'll be sorry. You <laughs> He's like trying to talk shit. He's like, wait, hold on. Let me tell you my sick bird. Disrupt him with combos. You know what you gotta. Huh. I think you gotta hit it when it's up in the air. Yeah. Well, it, it's like me, it goes down after a bit. Yeah. Here, it's about to go down. What's the point of that thing? It doesn't appear to. It's just being annoying, that's the point of it. Point is to be annoying. Did you just blow it up? Yeah. Fuck yeah. Cause I'm a bad bitch. I still don't understand why she would walk up to it and touch it, but okay. Oh come on! Oh, I have a new power. Okay. That turns robot units into allies who yes. will attack. All ground units and eventually self-destruct. I was just thinking, why can't we hack Robo friends? Robo friends. <laughs> uh oh! Whoa! Whoa! That's some uh, serious stuff. <laughs> Oh, it's self-destructed. Yeah. Okay. Because I don't think these robots actually have an attack. I think they just kind of like glomp around or something. How efficient? Who the fuck is designing this bullshit? Seriously, what is it? What is it? Just like. Uh, yeah. What? What? What they're gonna do is they're gonna fly around and like be kind of annoying. And you're like, everyone's like, brilliant, brilliant robot tactic. Oh, there's robots up there too. Yeah, I was trying to auto target them, but it wouldn't let me. It won't let you target the robot with the robot hack? It wasn't letting me do it before. Really? I just killed like half your friends. You'd think that at some point the trash talking would change to like, please, no, I have a wife and kids, don't do this. I'm just doing my job. You would think that, and I'd be, I would at least feel bad.
yogi hacking was always for the sake of it, for the purity of doing it. It's what I was meant to do. If somebody can tell you I was there, well, I didn't do it right. Impulse hacks, too. Hey, we, we were kids, right? If I see something, it's right there, I'll hack it. Now, when you grow up and get more organized about the world, you can concentrate and target something over time and with other people. It's more tricky, easier to fail. But then you can really achieve something. Time, consciousness, and collaboration. Now, that's taking hacking to a new level.